What is up guys and welcome to another video. Today I'll be showing you a new route to do on Red Dead Redemption Online that can make you a ton of money. Before we get into the video make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe and also make sure you turn on notifications to be notified when my next video goes live. As always with videos like this we want to be heading to roads but to make sure no one else is in the area we'll be spawning in tumbleweed and then fast traveling to roads. It does cost a bit of money but you'll be making that back in no time with what I'm about to show you. It does mean that there'll be no one else in this area that can potentially grief you and stop you from doing whatever it is you want to do. Now with this method there are three different parts of it and one of them there has been a problem with me but I'll talk about that once we get to it. The first thing you want to do is head down to the Braithwaite Manor and there you can actually do a jewellery glitch. If you haven't seen a previous video that I did on this method you can actually go into the Braithwaite Manor. As soon as you go in go to the right you can pick up some fine brandy. As soon as you've done that you can head up upstairs and the first door on your left go in there on the cabinet there is some jewelry you can pick that up and after that you can keep on just jumping off the balcony run to the outside of Braithwaite Manor run all the way back in and collect the jewelry again you must pick up the fine brandy this does not work if you do not pick up the fine brandy at first the fine brandy does not spawn over and over again like the jewelry does but you can keep on picking up the jewelry and jewelry normally goes for two dollars each you can only pick up five pieces of jewelry of each and normally there are only three it is very rare for you to get all 15 because it randomly gives you a piece of jewelry it doesn't say that you're gonna get this this time you're gonna get this this time it just says jewelry you pick it up and then it goes into your satchel as a platinum pocket watch a platinum necklace or a platinum bracelet once you've done the glitch at Braithwaite Manor for a couple of minutes and you have a full satchel of jewelry head down to this location this location normally you can get a cougar spawn the cougar spawn has gone down a lot since I've done a video of this a couple of weeks ago it seems that you have a 50 50 chance of whether or not you can get a cougar spawn i don't know why the spawn rate has just dropped massively but there are a lot of other animals that you can hunt here such as deer boar turkeys as well as a lot of other animals this is just the area where you can just do general hunting to go and get as much meat as possible you do want one animal either it be a turkey or a deer which is has not been skinned so you can use it for the next location but other than that you want to skin as many animals as you can and get as many animals on the back of your horse as possible after you've stacked your horse with as many skins as well as animal carcasses as possible head to this location and here we are going to do a bit of fishing so once you get here go and put your animal carcass down on a bit that just comes above the water as soon as you lay it down there pull out your fishing rod and immediately fish will start spawning in with that you're not going to use your fishing rod and unfortunately this is too much of an open space to be running back and forth so what you need to do is pull out your varmint rifle and just start shooting them now this is where I've had a bit of a problem for today when I was recording this video which is the 17th of February Fish are not going into my satchel. I do not know why it is. It seems to be a glitch or a bug with Red Dead Online, but I've seen that some people have it and other people don't. But every time I pick up fish, it says that I've picked it up, but as soon as I go back to the butchers, there is no fish to sell. I only have the animals that I got from the previous section. So any fish that I pick up, do not count towards anything in my satchel. You're gonna have to check this for yourself to see if it's working. Hopefully by the title update next week, this will all be sorted again, so you can carry on using this method. But as of right now, when I'm recording this video, I cannot pick up any fish, but it does seem like some people have this problem and some people don't. If this is working for you, all you have to do is keep on shooting the fish. There are a ton of fish. There's gotta be at least 25 fish that normally spawn in this area. All you have to do is keep on shooting them and then eventually, once you've done, once you've killed all the fish or your satchel is full, pick up the animal carcass that you laid down, put that back on your horse and then start heading back to roads to go and sell all your stuff at the butchers. On the way back, definitely look out for the different types of birds. Normally, you can get Get crows and all that which don't go for too much but there are some other birds that you'll definitely come across that actually go for quite a bit once you get back to road sell everything at the butchers you should be making yourself a decent amount of money I'll be surprised if you don't get at least $70 as well as go to the fence as well because of the jewelry you have to sell it there and you can make a lot of money from this within about 20 to 25 minutes you are making round about a hundred dollars it does take quite a bit of time to get through because there are so many different steps with the Braithwaite Manor, doing the glitch, coming down to another area to go and do some hunting, and then you're doing fishing. You're doing a lot of different things, but because it is all close together, this method works out really well and can become very, very profitable. For those that have the problem with the fish where they pick up the fish and it's not actually going
going in your satchel. Don't worry, hopefully this will be fixed within a couple of weeks or even a couple of days. I'm hoping that Rockstar know about this and it will get patched soon. And then this method will become very, very good for you. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. But for now, I'm going. So see ya.